The plan is to construct separate segments along the route of the tunnel, then gradually, over the remaining eight years, connect them together to make the completed tunnel. And each segment of tunnel also has its own maintenance tunnels and access tunnels. There are tunnels between tunnels and tunnels leading off from tunnels to get to other tunnels. And because they all look the same, I have no idea where I am, except that I'm somewhere beneath Italy, in a tunnel. Just have a thought. I am thousands of metres under a mountain range, in the dark, in a tunnel, plunging into the bowels of the earth. If Gandalf and a load of hobbits come the other way, I shan't be surprised. If they're pursued by orcs on scooters, I'll be furious. I hate scooters. What I need to do now is get to a maintenance tunnel being dug on the Austrian side of the Alps. So I'm leaving this tunnel to track around to the next bit. And I get to see the sun! Oh! Oh, that's warm on my legs! That is... That's just epic. Around 80 million tonnes of freight travels across the Alps every year, almost half of it going through a single congested pass between Italy and Austria. Europe hopes this new freight rail tunnel, two kilometres beneath the Alps, will carry a million tonnes of freight a year, taking thousands of lorries off the roads and transforming the way goods travel through the continent. This show is about a tunnel that's here to alleviate the terrible traffic congestion through the pinch point in the Alps. Well, I'm stuck in traffic. It's ironic, isn't it? Yeah, I really... Oh, wait till... Oh, hang on a minute. I can't hold back, I can't hold back. That's no good, I've got to go. Unlike the main rail tunnel bored by Flavia, maintenance and access tunnels like these are created the old-fashioned way, which means I get to blow something up. But first, explosives engineer Hubert Hoffman is going to show me how to drill the holes in the rock to put the explosives in. My friend here is going to help me have a go. I've got 100 holes to make here to blast this face. When... Oh, he's behind it! Oh, God! That could be horrible. OK. According to Hubert, blasting is an exact science. To create a perfect arch, the explosives have to be placed in a precise pattern and detonated at precise intervals. This is the plan of the explosives that are going to be put in this face to blow it. And they all have to be in the right place and at the right angle. That's what these long lines are for. Where do I go? Which one? Down here? That one. That one, yeah? I'm now going to start the drill. One touch. I mean, straight in. That is now drilling. We can see here how deep it's going. And that's retreated. So that's that one done. And now we're going straight in. Straight in. Oh, I'm getting this. <laughs> in it goes. The idea is that each explosive will detonate a fraction of a second before the one in the hole next to it. So the blasted rock moves into the space left by the previous explosion, and this pattern of holes should create a perfect arch. Project manager Michael Krontyler seems perfectly happy for me to handle some explosives. Hasn't he seen any of my shows? I'm, I'm standing next to a man with a handful of explosives. Yeah. What kind of explosive is it? It's a slurry cartridge. Yeah. It weighs 800 grams. Yeah. Uh, so we are charging approximately 2 kg per borehole. Right. And now it's your turn to do it. What, to charge it? Sure. Really? So he will just put in the detonator, and then you will charge the hole. <laughs> what is it? It's called slurry. It's like a gel. It's very special. Could you take this off me now, because it, it's explosive? I can hit you with that. I, I don't think you should. No, just put it inside. Oh, that's high tech. Yeah. What, do I, what do I do with that? 
So now take the stick yeah. and just push it in. If I do it wrong, are we all blown to pieces? Maybe. OK, thank you so much. <laughs> right, well, literally, this is like being in a cowboy movie, isn't it? You see the bit? Do it. Just push it in. Okay. How do I know when to stop? Push, 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 push. Am, am I too delicate-handed to be in? Push, push. <laughs> That's pushed. That's definitely in. Ah, it's even stronger. Oh, don't be ridiculous. It's explosive. <laughs> there are now a hundred of these sticks placed deep into the rock face. That's 200 kilograms of explosives, the same amount they packed into mines to sink battleships in the First World War, loaded and ready to blow. Time to retreat to a safe place next to the detonator, which, alarmingly, is just around the corner. And even more alarmingly, looks like something salvaged from the First World War. OK, wind it until you see the red light. Yeah. Then two or three turns more, and then he will say, thank you very much, boom. This feels like something out of a cartoon. But if it goes wrong, no one's laughing. Yeah, I'm a bit scared. That's the blasting machine. Yeah. OK. And you're going to let me do this? Sure. Come here. First thing is, you have to charge the machine, OK? That means you turn that lever until you can see the red light here. Yeah. OK, if you see the red light two or three turns more, yeah. that means the machine is fully charged. Yeah. And that's the magic button. Right. And I'm going to be allowed to do this. Yes. This isn't a dummy, this is yes. the actual one. Okay. One hand there. Yeah. I can't believe this is, okay. a, this is This is old school. Right. Do I want... Well, I am okay. quite scared. Turn, turn. Fast, 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 fast. Oh, this is more, 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 more. OK, OK, OK. OK, pushing yeah. the button. Told to open my yeah. mouth. Well done. Thank you. Glucow. <laughs> what does Glucow mean? Glucow. Thank you. That's a minus language. Is it? Yeah. Uh, that Glucow. was epic. Glucow. Thank you. Glucow. Yeah. So? You feel it, don't you? Yeah. You really You are do. shaking, man. Yeah, no, I have to tell you. You do feel that. That is yeah. properly thrilling. Yeah. I thought I'd, I'd be playing it cool, but wow. Oh, that was something else. Yeah. <laughs>